Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In my last week video, I talked about certain characteristics of binge. What happens when a person starts feeling the urge to eat, how we can divide the binges. Today, I'm going to be talking about what actually happens when the urge to eat is over. It is very common that when people, they stop the binge, they actually start to feel very panicking about the amount of food that they just consume. So they will start running in their mind through all the foods that they have eat, eaten. And some people, they will start adding up all the calories, trying to already make a plan what they're gonna do about it. And then with that, they will start feeling extremely guilty that they let themselves again to overeat, to binge, to have such a huge amount of food that will now affect their the size, their shape. It is very likely that with the guilt, person will also self-blame for not being strong enough, for being a weak person, for not being able to resist that urge to eat. Physically, the person will also feel a lot of discomfort in their body because they are really full up with food. And then because of that, that might then lead them to feel actually disgusted with themselves. Many people, they also reported at this point when the binge is over, when they sit there full up with food, when they feel all this discomfort in their body, when they're struggling with all these uncomfortable emotions, overwhelming emotions. They also, they will have sense of themselves being ugly and fat. And all this then will lead to them think about of ways how they can compensate for what they have just done. So they will think of ways of what to do to prevent them from gaining the weight. One of them, it is that people, they will self-induce vomiting. People, they might start using laxatives or they might start um, exercise excessively. When it comes to vomiting, people actually are reporting different types of sensations. So on one hand, they might describe feeling disgusting, um, feeling guilty, uh, feeling like they can't resist their urge to vomit after binging. But on the other hand, they will also report that there is that sense of feeling lighter after they vomit and also having that sense that something has been cleaned, that there's something that came out of them that wasn't acceptable. So in a way, the vomiting can give them actually sense of some sort of relief. It is also important to add that vomiting also creates a lot of physical strain on our body by increasing the heart rate. Um, people, they might start feeling dizzy and shivering and sweating. In situations when people are actually not satisfied with vomiting and they feel like they need to do something extra to prevent their weight gain, they might start using laxatives. And when people, they overdose on laxatives, what's dangerous is that they can easily become dehydrated and also they lose minerals that are needed for their body to function. Another thing which is quite dangerous when um, people are struggling with binging, it is the excessive exercising. Because if someone's heart rate is already increased, if they already feel dizzy, if they feel unwell, and if they maybe jump on a treadmill and they run for three, four hours, that puts even more um, pressure on the body. Another behavior that someone might be exhibiting um, in context of their binges, it is starvation. So people, they might be binging maybe for one or two days and then they might have maybe three days where they don't eat anything or maybe they eat maybe only like one meal a day, which consists maybe less than 500 calories. And in many cases, when people are actually stuck in this vicious cycle of binging and then starving themselves and vomiting or maybe excessively exercising, what the starvation vomiting does is only increases their urges to to binge that will be it for today and if you found this video any helpful then please like it subscribe and i'm gonna see you in the next one then thank you bye bye